What's up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joking John City 4 here bringing us more Black Ops 3 online multiplayer beta. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, make sure you leave a like on the video. Also, if you guys got any questions, make sure to leave it in the comment section. I'll read them later. So, anyways, moving on to the main topic of today. Eight weeks to go for Black Ops 3. The full game. I can't wait. Like right now, I'm like, you know, I have like the shape of the controller on my PS4. I'm like, I can't fucking wait. <laughs> you know, when I played the beta, I'm telling you, I saw something in this game. I was like, this game has potential. It is better so far. The beta, the beta itself was better than Call of Duty Ghost and Call of Duty Advanced Warfare combined. Like seriously, it was that pretty much well done. And you know, I want to give credit to Vonderkar and Treyarch for finally listening to us on some some of the things. Maybe I don't know. I just feel like they did something new here because Ghost and Advanced Warfare was total shit. I swear to God, when I was playing those two games, I just wasn't there 100% of the time. Yes, I might have posted some gameplays out there like little by little, but I wasn't there 100% of the time. I was like brain dead, you know. I was just forcing myself to put some videos out there because, you know, I just wanted to keep on uploading and I love to create stuff and giving up on those kinds of things just would just put me down. So that's why I didn't stop creating for uh, for those two games at all, like Call of Duty Ghost and Advanced Warfare, even though I hated those games. So um, it kind of felt like a job. I really didn't like my last two years with Call of Duty at all. Uh, but uh, Black Ops 3, I have this feeling that it will be successful. I will be posting up like crazy ass gameplays. I have a feeling that at some point I will be hitting 90 kills like again. Because uh, this game feels so much upgraded compared to Black Ops 2. Black Ops 2, I'm telling you, it's a piece of shit right now. Some of you guys might think like, oh no, Black Ops 2 right now is a pretty much a well done game. Hell no. If you play Black Ops 2 on the first three months of the year, when Black Ops 3, Black Ops 2 was released, that game was a solid A+. It was competing on, even against Modern Warfare 2 and even Black Ops 1 itself. So, I'm telling you, they had a chance with Black Ops 2, but they fucked it up because Von der Haar decided to freaking nerf every single weapon out there. The assault rifles, SMGs, and it made the game more fucked up because only the snipers were not affected, so everybody can quickscope. Even myself, I can quickscope. I did a whole series on it called uh, Face Off Battles. And that was me quickscoping, and I always said, I'm not even a quickscoper. I'm 100% a rusher, and I hate quickscoping. So uh, that was kind of weird that I was allowed to be quick scoping in Black Ops 2 because I'm just a rusher. So uh, anyways, yeah, like hopefully if they, if they don't fuck up like in Black Ops 2, we might have a solid game, a solid futuristic game for once. Because I know Destiny players out there are going to be like, no, Destiny is the shit, you know, you got to play it at least once. Fuck no, I sold that game because it wasn't even creative at all. This year, I believe is more creative than the previous years because you can customize your own paint shop weapon. But I know some of the parts are not edible. You know, in the on the weapon because it covers sometimes your your whole emblem. So uh, that's kind of dumb. That should really allow us to customize the whole damn weapon. If they can do that, I might give the paint shop even a higher grade because right now I'm giving it a C minus for not allowing us to customize the whole damn thing. So, uh, but they do have paint shop. The weapon customization is still the same from the previous years. I mean, it just hasn't changed. You still have your foregrip, your uh, stock attachment, your your uh, long barrel, you know, and everything is the same thing. I know that, but at the same time, you know, you kind of miss those attachments. I don't know. I just have, I haven't been all there like in the past years. And this year, I feel like I'm awake. I feel like I have, you know, relived and, you know, I'm standing back into Call of Duty. Because in the past years, I'm telling you, I wasn't there all the time. I might have sounded like I was there, but I'm telling you, I just wasn't into it anymore. I was like already done with the series. But this year, I think it woke me up a little bit. So. Let's see what happens, because this year I'm planning to put more gameplays, more strategies, more best class setups. I mean, you already saw some best class setups even on the beta. That's faster than Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. This year, Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, I barely po posted any kind of best class setups. And this year, bam, like right away, two right away. I was about to post like around three or four more, but, you know, I didn't have enough time with the beta to test out more of my weapons, because I want my weapons to be 100% solid. So, uh, if I would have had like another week, maybe I would have come out like with around four more best class setups, I'm telling you. I have a feeling that this year I will be hitting over 100 kills or something because I feel better. I feel like better with using the SMGs especially. I'm a rusher, so I need SMGs out there because I want to be fast. And, you know, it allowed me to have all of that again. It's been a while, I'm telling you. That's how long it's been for me. 
like the last time I enjoyed playing some Call of Duty game was Black Ops 2 before all the fucking updates, of course. So, um, so yeah, guys, this year expect a lot from me. I'll be going all out 100% of the time. I will not be giving up this year. I'm telling you, I'm just going to keep on going forever until you guys see me get 100 kills and you should be able to see that I'm a great player out there. So, um, so yeah, you know, I'm, I'm ready this year. I am ready. So, eight more weeks to go. Black Ops 3. What do you guys think? Do you guys want the game already or, you know, whatever. Just post in the comment section. I'll read it later. If you guys want to see more gameplays, more FPS games, you know, subscribe right now because it's going to be a lot of stuff coming up. And also, when Black Ops 3 releases, I'm telling you, I'm going to go chaos mode and kill everybody out there. So, that is it. And subscribe for more.